Hello, I'm Mr. Priscilla, and right now what I want to do is illustrate the circle graphing tool that we're using when graphing circles. This is the second video in the circles lecture. And we've already said that if you have an equation written for a circle written in center radius form, in order to find the center and the radius, you change the sign of the number in the parentheses with the x, change the sign of the number in the parentheses with the y, that gets you the center. So, changing the sign on the number in the parentheses with the x, that's a positive 3 and a negative 2. And then to get the radius, you take the square root of that last number. The center and radius are what you're going to need in order to graph a circle. This is a circle that's centered at ne 3, negative 2 with a radius of 5. So to get started, I'm going to always like to blow this up. And it sort of walks you through. Okay, in the yellow box. Choose the tool. Well, this is a circle. Now it says, click the graph to plot the center. I'm going to Notice I move around. What was that center? Three, negative two. In the yellow box, it says the center is three, negative two. That's the point I have there. So I click, and now notice all the circles that are centered there. To find your circle, you're going to start at the center and move five units. Up one, two, oops. No, I had it. One, two, three, four, five. There. So I click the center, and then I moved out five units, the radius. Now I'll say, so click the center, then move five units over. Save it. Check it. Let's do one more of these. Remember to find the center and radius. Change the sign, change the sign, square root. Okay. What's the center? The center will be negative 2, negative 4. The radius, take the square root, it's a 4. Change the sign, change the sign, square root. Graph it to blow it up. This is a circle. So you start off plotting the center. Left two down four. I'm not sure if this works. Oh, okay. It did that. And now I need to move over the radius. The radius is four. So let's see. Have I moved over four? One, two, three, four, yes. So save. Check your answer. Very nice little graphing tool to graph a circle. Okay? Well, this is Mr. Priscilla just demonstrating that circle graphing tool in my math lab. So uh, next thing we'll be doing is discussing completing the square so we can take a circle that's written in expanded form and write it so that it's in that center radius form because then it's so easy to find the center and radius. Just change the sign, change the sign square root. That's what the next videos are, so thanks for watching. Bye-bye.